What's up everybody? This is Dane with Trail Peak. Gonna do a uh, quick little bike check on, on the new whip. This is a Santa Cruz Hightower LT. It's a medium frame. Um, this one is 150 millimeters of travel and a slightly slacker head tube angle compared to the regular Hightower from last year. Um, no new changes on the regular Hightower this year. Um, this is just the long travel version of the, uh, the original Hightower. So this is a medium frame. I'm about five foot nine, weigh 160 pounds. Um, out back here, we got the brand new DPX2 Air Shock. Um, leaving this one on for now. Maybe, maybe gonna throw the coil on down the road if I feel like this one isn't handling it as well. Um, but this one so far has been phenomenal. So yeah, DPX2 out back. Um, running about 180 PSI in the rear shock. Up front, we got the Fox Float 36, 160 mils of travel, um, 51 millimeter offset. Uh, yeah, what can I say? Same setup from the, the Jeff C. I got two orange volume reducers in the air sleeve. As for compression, um, running about five clicks of low speed and six clicks of high speed and the rebound right about in the middle so for the drivetrain running the new x01 eagle 12 speed drivetrain running a 34 tooth chain ring up front and that's paired with the eagle uh, 50 tooth out back got sram guide rsc brakes front and rear um, 180 mil rotor up front, 180 out back. Got Santa Cruz carbon bars up front here, 20 millimeter rise. These are cut to 770 millimeters. So we've got the Fox Factory Kashima transfer post here, 150 millimeters of drop. We've got a WTB Silverado saddle, titanium railed up top there. Up front here, we got the Race Face Turbine 50 millimeter stem. It's got a six degrees of rise. Underneath the stem here, running 15 millimeters of stack. So the wheels on this bike, I've got the brand new Santa Cruz Reserve 30 carbon wheel set. These are laced to the DT Swiss 350 hubs. No questions asked, lifetime warranty, you break it, send it back in, ship you out a new one. And tires on this bike, up front, we got a WTV Vigilante, 2.3 inches wide. And that's the tough casing, high grip. Out back here, we've got the WTV 2.3 inch wide breakout. And again, that's the tough casing, high grip. Couple little things to note on this bike. Running the Marsh Guard fender up front here. Um, got a water bottle cage and rocking a E13 TRS Plus chain guide and a bash guard on the bottom there. Pedals on this bike, Shimano XT Trails, same as all my other bikes. And uh, for the grips, we've got the DMR Brendog Death Grips on here. So yeah, that's the bike.